Torres family bunch. So we are going on a date on a night. Date. Uh, this is starting out our weekend vlog. So I hope you guys just come along and follow along. I know we won't be doing too much talking in this bit. Yeah, um, in tonight's bit. Yeah, because we're just going to spend time, one-on-one -on -one time with each other. It's been a long time. Long time since a date, huh? Yeah, super long time. Grocery grocery shopping does not count. No. So we're excited, so let's go. Pressure washed it down. Oh, it's Perfect gentleman. We had a productive day today. Cruz and the baby stayed home and uh, got the grocery order. And I went to a nearby city about an hour away, maybe even less than an hour. I don't know, maybe an hour. And I actually, they had Aldi's over there. So I'll show y'all after a while what I got from Aldi's. But for dinner, we kind of had a late lunch. So I'm just doing, um, I'm just doing a few of these pork and vegetable dumplings and I pan fried them in some olive oil. I'm drinking a glass of water with it and CJ's having some leftovers for dinner. He's already ate some chicken strips. Yummy, yummy. It was yummy. Rawr. He's talking about his tiger. Rawr, huh? Yummy, yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy. But that's what we're doing. I don't know what Cruz is gonna eat. But um, I did get this candle from Aldi's. And it smells super good. It's pumpkin ginger snap. I was actually very impressed with all these uh, prices. So I actually stocked up on a few things that I don't have here. So I had to buy like a like a cold bag and everything. So, but it worked out pretty good. And the house is a mess because I got to put stuff away. Put stuff in their um, containers in, the, in here. Y'all, this is a mess. <laughs> My pantry is a mess. A mess. Huh. So we're gonna finish eating. That's right. And then a subscriber sent us this box of fall goodies and everything. Thank you, Kendra. She also has a channel called Kendra Full of Joy. And um, so y'all go subscribe. She's super cute, super friendly, such a nice person. And um, I found some of these magnets in there and CJ. Yeah, that's right. And you're lying, huh? And CJ's been playing with them. So thank you, Kendra. Good evening, everyone. It's Sunday evening. We done had church. Next steps. Lunch with my parents and my brother. I'm doing laundry this evening. My beautiful wife over there is getting stuff ready for meal prep this week. We got some ground meat going on for some stuffed bell peppers. Oh, stuffed bell peppers are already in the oven. I'm sorry. 
Uh, then I can do a little more time on the cheese, maybe. And then this is for the lasagna. And then I'm guessing this water is for also for the lasagna. The noodles. And then we have some minced garlic and some onions prepped up over here. Me and CJ snacked on a few M&Ms. That's why he's saying me, me right now. And nummy, nummy. And my wife is making some homemade French bread. Mm, this is not French. This is pizza dough. Pizza dough, sorry. But I use it for calzones. For calzones. I thought you was making French bread. Mm -hmm. No. Okay. I, I will, but. So I'm doing meal prep, as y'all saw, and I just made a nine by 13 worth of lasagna this is for us that's one serving this whole thing's full of lasagna 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 all four of these are full of lasagna i made some homemade bread tonight i don't know what made me think doing all this daddy what time is it Almost yeah so meal prep nights are really late i mean it is a good little side gig that i'm doing so but all this is homemade fresh bread like it sounds hollow nice and fresh and yummy and then I did calzones some homemade calzones with homemade dough and everything and I got another set of them in the oven turn that ring light off and then what else and then in here we have stuffed bell peppers I can actually show y'all because I never show y'all show y'all me cooking all this, but I do it. A lot of meal preps. Stuffed bell peppers. And y'all stuffed bell pepper. The filling I do, the like it's so simple. So delicious though. Like this the most simple recipe I have ever done. And it's so delicious. But that's that. We're just waiting on this. Wait for everything to cool down, wrap up the bread. My kitchen was a huge mess, huge flour everywhere. Almost ready to go to bed and the other calzones. They look super delicious. I always put them under the broiler just a little bit to get a better color on top. They look really good. They're not burnt. They just look super, super good. Okay. So you guys, what, what what I got from Aldi, so I do not have an Aldi near me. It's about almost an hour and a half away from me. So some things we don't have here or as cheap as they do at Aldi. This was a really small Aldi though. Like it was really, really small. But I went ahead and grabbed two cans of pumpkin because they were 28 cents. I mean, hello. Like that's a good deal. Here I think you can probably get it for 83 cents or so, I think. Don't don't count me on that but it's more than this um i don't know how much everything is but i picked up some dried mixed berries for my poppies or for snacking for anybody lately frozen reese's have been super delicious so i pull those out of the freezer this is the next night this is sunday actually so <laughs> i was supposed to show you guys last night but i went to bed um it is so hard to come by some chocolate mochi. Our Kroger used to carry it, but they no longer do it. They used to have the mochi in like a case where you picked it out and you put it in your own container. Like they had all different kinds of flavors laid out and you just picked it up, put it in your own little box tray. Um, but since COVID, they took that out. So I found some double chocolate for my husband. I actually ate two. I think he's ate two. So we've just really been enjoying that. My biggest find there was this pork sausage. I threw everybody in the freezer. I think I'm gonna pull one out for for breakfast. Um, but uh, this is two dollars and twelve cents at all these, or the one here where we live. And here at like our Walmart per se, it's three eighty eight for a tube of pork sausage. So I was like, heck yeah! I stocked up on the on a few. I think. We're gonna go back to this Aldi, pick up a cooking spray and um, cause we were running low. Now the olive oil one was like $2. This one was like $1.29. So I just went with the original canola spray. It works. But 
that's my little Audi find and then my candle I showed y'all yesterday. So I think I'm going to go back and pick up some more baking stuff and some more canned items. We don't have a big pantry to store stuff, but I know winter's coming and traveling, everything is going to go up in price. A lot of, a lot more people on the roads. So I'm just going to try to stock up now because Thanksgiving is right around the corner. And I think we're hosting here at our La Casa. So that's that. So I'm pulling out dinner for tomorrow night. I got my parents coming over because we have this huge thing of lasagna to eat. Like, and I'll probably send them home some. Um, so, but we're gonna do this for dinner, the slow roasted golden rotisserie flavor, whatever that means. Dry rubbed with seasoning, fresh pork tenderloin. I wonder what it's gonna taste like. I wonder if I need to add some seasoning to this. Hopefully it will be good enough. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull that out. I'm gonna do one of these sausages for tomorrow and we're gonna do some biscuits and gravy for breakfast, I think. Or, or I'll pull this, or I'll pull the sausage out, leave it out and do some French toast for breakfast out of some of this French bread. I think I might do that, but these guys need to be wrapped up. One's gonna be for garlic bread. Well, two are going with that other, with our friend. And then two are for us. So I gotta figure out what I wanna do with these. Oh, daddy, we can do French bread pizza. Yeah, that, mm, that would be good. All right, Torres family bunch, that is it for this vlog. I know it wasn't too intense. We were just super busy today. Cruz, 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 <laughs> Cruz, Cruz told y'all that earlier, but um, we were super busy today, so I didn't get a lot. And then yesterday I went to my, um, my mother-in-law, Cruz's aunt and Cruz's grandma. And so we had a great time. So I just wanted to be in the, in the moment, but I did get a few clips of that. Y'all already saw that, but I just want to thank y'all for watching and always being so supportive of us. And I hope you guys have a great day or a great night or whatever time you're watching this. And I'll see you next time. Bye.